has died after losing his battle with cancer. Now, we first introduced you to Travis Peterson here on 2 News a few months ago. He's the assistant Cache County Fire Chief. He had a dream that he was determined to chase in his final months, and in a small way, part of his dream came true. For the past few months, Angie Peterson's house has seen one visitor after another. I'd say, are you sure you don't need to lay down? And he's like, nope, there, people are here to see me. Each minute count. They came to see her husband, Travis, a friendly, outgoing firefighter battling terminal cancer. And did he have something to show them? Travis, thank you for all you have done for your community from one maverick to another, Tom Cruise. Now, if you knew Travis at all, you knew he loved Top Gun. They would have constantly given me a hard time about having a Tom Cruise cry. One of his last wishes was to meet Tom Cruise and fly in a fighter jet. That didn't end up happening. His wife said it didn't matter. He's kind of like a little kid at Christmas time. This poster, which arrived unexpectedly in the mail, became a point of pride for the dying firefighter. I'm sure we'll have it framed and hung up in his office for him. He also got a box. Quite a bit of shirts. <laughs> with more Top Gun memorabilia than he could probably imagine. A Top Gun suit. But in the end, this story isn't about Top Gun. It's about a man who kept his dreams in sight, even at the end, and kept a smile on his face because of it. I think that helped all of us. His positive attitude, he will be greatly missed, but his memory... We'll make sure it lives on. Travis Peterson's funeral is set for this Saturday. He was 36 years old. He leaves behind his wife, Angie, and one daughter, Lydia. Up next on Tuners, a major recall.